the midline of a triangle. The last couple of videos we've been discussing the auxiliary lines of triangles. We are now doing the midline. So, here, here are the five auxiliary lines of a triangle. The median, the midline, the altitude, the perpendicular bisector, and the angle bisector. This is where we're at right now. If you don't understand this, you need to go back a few videos to catch up so that you're not missing anything. Remember, math is like a layer cake. You cannot work on the third layer of the cake if you haven't even done the first or second layer yet. The third layer would be floating in the air. That's impossible, okay? So, this is the midline. It is a line that cuts across the triangle from one midpoint to another midpoint. It connects two midpoints, and it's parallel to this line here, the line it doesn't touch. See that? So, here's another midline. It's coming from this midpoint to that midpoint. Here's another one. It's going from this midpoint to that midpoint. Now, what's cool about the midline is it is half the length of this baseline right here. This one is half the length of that. This one is half the length of that. It's half the length of the big line that it's not touching. If you multiplied it by 2, it would equal the line it's not touching. So guess what? I get to throw another theorem at you that you're going to be able to use in proofs. Here we go. The midline of a triangle is parallel to the third side. It's parallel to this third side. See? Which means it's parallel to the side it doesn't touch. You can see the two parallel lines there. Parallel lines, parallel lines. Here's the other theorem. The midline is half as long as the third side of the triangle. And that means the midline is half the length of the side it doesn't touch. Like I was saying before, if you actually take this midline right here, okay, and we measure it, see? See my pink mark on my protractor? If we go like this and we line it up, you can see that that's how long it is. Okay? See that? And that is, there's one here and there's one here. This is exactly half the length of this one. Now you're going to be able to use that in proofs in the future. If something says, you know, how can you prove that this, you know, Bottom line here is that long, you can say, my proof is that it is twice the size of the midline. So that's going to come up. So that's the midline of a triangle. We're going to talk about the altitude of a triangle next, this one, which is actually just the height.